I think one of the biggest misconceptions of being a Christian is that once you accept Jesus into your heart and receive the Holy Spirit, you're in unicorn land where all your problems disappear. When the truth is, some days will be like today, like me. When you just want to lie on the ground, give up, and wait for Jesus to return. But the word of the Lord says, rejoice in the Lord always, and again I say rejoice. So that's what we'll be doing today, occupying myself with things that bring me even the slightest bit of joy. Because I can't lie, this week has been a bit rough. Rainy, gloomy, and my period's right around the corner, so my emotions are all over the place. And shucks, darn it, I'll admit it, some people just got me mad and hurt my feelings. And if that wasn't enough, it is tax season and Uncle Sam is knocking at the front door. So I decided to do my hair, because I always feel happy when my hair is done. I do have plans to put in some passion twists later on, but I just needed something natural. I I didn't want to put in no extensions. Sometimes you just want to feel natural, you know? So I called up my cousin who's a hairstylist. I just love hanging out with her. She's just a ray of sunshine. Look at this, just laughing, having a good time. It's just like therapy, you know? There's just something about a sister or mother doing your hair. It's just unexplainable. Next, we decided to go watch a movie. So I called up my big sis. And if it's one thing about the Fitzpatrick Five is if you call one of us, you call all of us. So all of my siblings came through. Mashanda, our friend, came through, and my cousin. And we enjoyed the movie. And this girl had the gall to sleep through the movie and ask us who the monkey was. The movie was King Kong, y'all. Anyway, that's why we love Mashonda. She always puts a smile on our face. And here are my little brother and sister who decided to do a speed walking race after the movie. Now, another random thing that makes me happy are fruits. Chopped up fruits, to be exact. I really wanted some mangoes, but the store that I went to didn't have, so I just took the fruits that I could find and made this yummy, refreshing fruit salad. And, ooh, yes, that tajin. Mm-hmm. I love it. Next, I decided to take a long, hot shower. The shower, honestly, is like my favorite part of the day, but... Today, I allowed myself to go extra with the heat and extra with the time. No judgment. I also decided to wear my favorite pajamas. I just love pajamas. I have a little obsession with them. So I decided to lay out my favorite, favorite one and go downstairs and, of course, now talk to Jesus because I had a lot on my mind. And when I tell y'all, y'all think my videos are a joke. That's really how I be talking to my daddy. I snitch on everybody who hurt me, okay? And I honestly felt so good after this long chat with my daddy. To wrap up the night, I put on a YouTube video that my mom sent me because she always sends me some good like sermons to watch. And I ate my fruit salad, finished, brushed my teeth, put back in my retainers because if y'all know, I did do Invisalign so I have to wear retainers for the rest of my life. But whatever. I play this weird game that's fun to me where I choose which side of the bed I sleep on for that night because I can't sprawl out on the bed. I always have to sleep on one specific side. Well, that's all for the night. I really enjoyed my day and I guess I'll see y'all next time for ovulation.